Ooh, those are your siblings, parents, quibbling. Is that even a word? House of Gucci. Better see beneath their skin because you don't know what their heart is pumping. They might want something. They weren't part of the family. So when they came, it wasn't fate or destiny. Well, actually, could be. At the end of the day, everything worked out for Gucci to be a household name. But who had to experience defeat because someone's heart had to skip some beats? There wasn't true rhythm. No, that's not quite it either. Because she did love him. But also sent him to the Grim Reaper. But she gave him a chance. She came to his apartment or house complex or mansion, whatever it's complex. And tried to make it advance. Tried to show her love, even made something to show it. Give that truth a little shove. But he shoved it back. I wasn't having that. So after that, it was just time to attack. And she hired a fortune teller. Because I'm assuming, I would assume she paid her. And they became friends. Be careful of the guidance that you let in. And then the fortune teller had some amigos that can send someone to the dirt below. And they did so. And even though she did like actually like love him, even though she was attracted potentially initially by money. She also was hungry for money. That was part of the desire. In fact, initially, that pretty much was the desire. Was she not already with the dude when she went to that party? Did she stick by his side? Hardly. But at the same time, I mean, that's a Gucci. That's opportunity. In a sense, can you blame her? Unless her and other dude had, like, a relationship with a genuine signature. Because I don't know how hard she was actually vibing with dude previous. And if she wants money, it makes sense. Maybe that's why people don't go for me romantically. Partially because I'm closer to ugly. At least to a degree. But then part of it might be the money. Even though I have character and I'm silly and all this and that. People might just want some stacks and attractiveness with that. I just have character and complexity. <laughs> Shoo, but then maybe I belong in the house of Gucci. But is that a family of heart? Did anyone respect Paolo's art? Or give him guidance or give him love? Actually, his dad did. After a presence in the prison came to an end. Guess that's some reformation. Guess there is love in the Gucci family tree. Eventually, that dad and that son, that one, Paolo, because with all that son did, 
if the movie's accurate, there is a love at the end that was adamant and adequate if these representations on the screen are accurate. People change. People come into your life and rearrange your elements and grow flowers or weeds or both. We'll see. And keep your fortune teller, please.